this is a telepathic message. No, you're not going crazy. You're just insane. Anyway, let's see if we can beat the Jill Bishop with Toma. Ganzan Hachiku! Two hydro characters, let's see if we can beat this. He's a level one Toma now. Hopefully Toma doesn't die a billion times. You make it easy for Toma because you're already killing yourself. That's sad bro. It must be quite lonely in this game. Are you really trying to crush my water bender? What's wrong with you? He's like a male version of Kita. And we have Barbara here, literally singing in front of a monster with no fear. Is that one an idol is these days? That Joe Bishop is kind of thirsty. Let's give him some water. How was that? Was it refreshing? Toma, a GOV shop doesn't appreciate you making it hot again. Damn, he wants to slam you to the ground. He's like those weird anime guys that slap the hand on the wall for no reason. They think it's cool, but it's not. Only reason it makes their heart throb is because you made them scared. After we're done with you, you'll have a full bath. You'll be cleaner than anything on yourself. It seems you like spinning. You must have been a top in your past life. Or maybe a fidget spinner. Bro, stop hitting yourself. Isn't gonna be Genki anytime soon. I'm over here. Are you pointing that dragon bear? But you were the only one who could spin. Even Barbara can spin. Look at this. Amazing, isn't it? Are you jealous? Seems like you're getting tired. That's what you get for eating flies in the morning. Maybe consider eating 10 ganyus every morning. The ganyu is part of a complete breakfast. But tell it to eat Zhao also, but he's always salty. He will just give you high blood pressure. <laughs> I've washed your face like a million times and you still look ugly. That's pretty sad, bro. Don't worry, I shall put you out of your misery. Music what? I think you swallowed some words there, Barbara. That's the symphony of death. <laughs> you almost died, Barbara. 
Goodbye, old friend. See you in the next life, if you have one. Anyway, thanks for watching and subscribe. If you don't want a boogeyman to eat your toes, toes are precious, don't let him eat it.